Hi everyone, Andrea here and as part of Immortal Marilyn's week-long theme of you and your collection, I'm just going to give you a quick overview of the bits of my Marilyn collection that are actually on display. You'll have to excuse the, the mess in the book room, which is where most of the stuff is. I, I am trying to, to sort it out. So this is going to be a handheld video in various rooms, so it's going to be a little bit off and go. But uh, let's have a look at the collection, shall we? Okay, so I'm just going to have a quick look at the top of my bookcases. And as you can see, there are some dolls. They're from DSI. There's some stationery. Some salt and pepper shakers. There's a bottle of Marilyn Merlot with a lovely David Conover Norma Jean on it. A Marilyn and Seven Rich Figurine Dome. Another bottle of wine. Some more DSI dolls. Another bottle of wine. Um, that's a tin that somebody made for me. Another dome with some like it hot. There's a Gentle for Blondes diamonds figurine, some 70 rich figures, some more wine, some more DSIs, across here more wine, so just going to stuff across here so you can see it there's some trading cards and they're the Andrew Dennis ones, some Marilyn figurines, a Marilyn bobblehead, a uh, Franklin Mint doll, uh, some more domes, more figurines, lighter and a bottle of vodka. It's got barrels on it, believe me. Across this one, oops, we've got some of my, my Barbie dolls. Um, and some little things behind this. Hang on a second, this one. Just gonna move that down. There are these. These are actually Marilyn cigarettes. <laughs> very, very bizarre. And we've got some more figurines and the car. Then here I have my G.I. Jane Marilyn doll and another Marilyn Barbie a lunchbox and a Marilyn vanity case This in here I have all my Marilyn photographs in the bottom one I have uh, some old ones so this she says that it what it was and was who is it from per, from a periodical library I've got a few of those and then there's this one which is a contact sheet I think it's going to focus because it's quite close up of the misfits there you go the other one isn't Marilyn but it is Marilyn's favorite actress it's uh, all my millions and millions of Jean Harlow photos. Coming down into this next section, and you'll have to excuse the things in on the way. These are photo albums, but they're not just photo albums. And I'm just going to pull one out and show you. So you can see the Marion cushion there as well. These are my Marilyn scrapbooks. That I've been keeping since I started collecting Marilyn in the early 1990s so there's actually 22 volumes on there and I actually have 23 volumes there is another one and I've got another one to do because I've got a lot of clip-ins and I'm going to show you those now this pile this is all clip-ins to go in my scrapbooks all of that for the last carrying on this is stuff that's in my actual bedroom or our bedroom and I've got there's a little Marilyn aqua blaster and a figurine and then there's a big bust and then there's two lamps coming across from the lamp I have one of my Milton Green prints and again another one there is another Milton Green print but it's not actually uh, up at the moment so in here we have all my cups my Marilyn mugs, lots of different ones. Let's make love, and there's a nice Norma Jean one. I have a wine glass with Marilyn on, which a friend had made for me. And there's more mugs up there, like some glasses. Face pot mug. First mug I ever got was this one. Up here, and that was actually from a certain garage. And my dad got me that. So that's like, where 25 years old 
So that's there. And then up on the top, have my Marilyn Monroe cookie jar, which came all the way from America and actually survived, which is fantastic. So that's the, all of the collection I'm going to show you for now. Um, the rest of my Marilyn collection is actually in storage, and this includes all my magazines and calendars and plates and lots of other knickknacks. But uh, hopefully, I'll get them out and show you another time. So thanks for watching. Bye.